In this Cypress video, we are going to see how to run multiple JavaScript spec files at once. So this is very easy, guys. Uh, so simply we have to use the npx command followed by that Cypress run hyphen hyphen browser and then browser name and hyphen hyphen spec. And after that, you can add a n number of selected JavaScript dot JS file. That's a spec files. So here I will go to the VS code. I will show you an example. So here I want to run the Cypress selectors test.cy.js file and I will run the second file that is a Cypress xpath test.cy.js. So here I will open the command prompt. So just now I, I tried executing it. So we have to enter the first npx command followed by that Cypress and run and half after that we have to specify hyphen browser and then we have to specify the browser name and then we have to specify the hyphen hyphen spec so in the double quotes we have to specify the file names so simply right click on the respective javascript spec file and simply select the option as copy relative path and paste paste the file location so that's the first file location now i will add the second spec file location so here i will copy the relative path that's it and i will hit the enter so it is throwing some error so let's check the what exactly it is the error so we have not provided a space here after the hyphen hyphen spec so let's add this add the space here that's it guys now it should start executing the tests which are there inside the two spec file and if you see here so this is the cypress version and our tests are getting executed in the headless mode of the chrome browser version 117 so this is a node version what currently our Cypress is using and if you see the specs here so there are two spec file found so be, if you look at here so here we have passed a two spec files and after that you can see the complete path of the JavaScript spec file so this is the first spec file location and this is the second spec file location so it will take some time because it has the ui scenario so where we are navigating in the youtube.com and uh, actually firstly we are navigating to the google.com google page and where from the google page we are navigating to the one of the youtube playlist so let's wait for a couple couple of seconds so it will currently it is executing the cypress selectors test.cy.js file and if you see here so right now it is executing the first suit file so it depends on the internet as well so if your internet is uh, faster it will execute the test faster so let's wait for a couple of seconds then it will throw the all the results and if you see here so it, it has already executed the code so I will go up so firstly it has executed the first spec file that is a Cypress selector suit so that's one of one and here you can see how many tests are there so one only one test was there and that is getting passed and after that so this is a second suit that is the Cypress XPath suit and it has only one test and that is getting passed and at the end you can see the how many specs files are there and each spec file wise you can see the whether test is passing or whether test is failing so in our case we had two spec file and two test all the tests are getting passed here and also you can see the duration of the test execution so a second test it took the 14 seconds and first test took the 25 seconds right 
So this is how you can execute the multiple JavaScript spec, spec files in the Cypress automation testing.